Morning is folks. This is Mix Gomez at your service alongside Javi Palanya and she Reggie Boy Basibas will give them a lot of versatility in both in their previous game. He had to play point guard against Batangas as JR Flores goes all the way for two points. This game para sa Bulacan. We say Koga now on the drive and the layup on the other end. With a full step in front of his defender. Jera Flores answers back quickly for these two teams. And so I ask you this question. You think there's a, pl a problem defensively that we're seeing right now in this game? Did mention that is what he can provide for Bacolod as he scores inside basket and one. And aside from those things that we already talked about, Mix, the basketball and cut around the shaded area to be able to make himself available for passes just like that. You know, Reggie Boy Basibas has been around for quite a time here in the MPBL and he does know how to act like a true professional and adjust to new set. And so he's able to fight through it. Renz Kapulong, three-pointer. Outside shooting, that's really... But in terms of the guards... Puro mga slasher. And you need that versatility in terms of showing up Gabayni sa kanilang team. And there, it was only their last game against Batangas where they missed the prevents a lot of the easy drives and attacks to the basket. That's why. Here he is, right on cue. But he's blocked. Forward pass. Antimbuhan on the escape. Here's the steal. I mean, the block rather. Katimbuhan running all the way on the other side, unchallenged for the deuce. I like how you described that. As had in terms of the success in closing out games, they defeated Nueva Ecija. Patriots. Here's Renz Capulong. They, they give it over to Jeremy Cruz. That guy made five threes in the previous outing versus Batangas. You know, last year when he was given, given the moment when he was with Batangas City, I felt like that. But he made sure that his return was going to be in that game versus Patangas. And so he delivered very well. And then, Abad Sirusei Koga, three pointer for Bacolod. In this game. Well, being a streaky shooter, it can go both ways. Yeah, it's a blessing and a curse. Forward pass. An easy two for Renz Kapulong, who is feeling very comfortable against Quezon City. I'm going to look forward to that just because. Quezon City is already transitioning into new own Andre Dorem. Sorry, Andre Flores and uh, Michael Enriquez. Andre Dorem, this I believe, has already moved on. Now Bulacan's on the run again. Guevara, one, two, what a move! Able to contribute here. Pinoy step to evade Justin Alano on the semi transit story. And uh, as sports fans, we all love to hear. Oh, 10 seconds to go, Manu. The coconut capital of the Philippines. We are in Quezon. First game at hand is Bacolod versus Bulacan. Mix Gomez, Avi Palanya, Sheila Salay side. And we are also featuring this guy, Gilmer De La Torre. Ano, Val Chauca, Reggie Boy Basibas, and Justin Alano. Chauca with the fake. Good one at that. Mid-range, short, rebound, Basibas. This guy has been playing. Think about Val Chauca. He may continue to miss, but he will continue to shoot, and he might actually come up and alive in the clutch once more. There's that collision with Justin Alano that apparently caused the fall by De La Torre, but he looks to be okay. Oh, parang wala nangyari nga. Improvements and the effort that he's trying to make towards adjusting it, it's... it's that being out of control, you know. He gets the offensive board and the putback. Ivara now has six. Lalo na pag ang breaks of the game, hindi pumapabor sa amin. This is according to Coach Monel Calios. Since it's already the mid-season, Bacolod. Brothers, Mac Montilla, Harold Arboleda, as you get to see the steal and layup for Gilmer De La Torre, who doesn't look to be injured in any angle. So Jeremy, stepping back. That short. Oh, great effort inside by halfway through the second. Ryusei Koga in and out. Sedilio with another offensive board. In that stretch four position for Bacolod in the past couple of outings. Chauka mid range, yes. Renz Capulo on the other end. The leading scorer of the Bulacan Cuyas. That's a miss. And the putback was there. Back to JR. 
Five on the shot clock. They go to Kapulong. Three-pointer. That's another one for Renz. And even with his step backs, take a look at it. Again, it's not that clear. But uh, jump shot yung kay Luka Doncic. Eh. Yung kay Renz kasi he really jumps higher on his inventory of the redeemed team. Yep. You can watch it on Netflix. There's a miss here by Cedillo in the putback for Matiliano. The breaks, unlike when you are already an established player, kalaban mo na lang sarili mo. Eh. Yes. In some days, he might have dunked that basketball, but not today. Just the easy two for him. Patient for them to try and really perform well against the top teams in the MPBL. The system that Coach Jericho Daniera is trying to put in place here. After the basket by Daniel De Guzman, Alfred Cedillo. Sai at kami po ay nagpapasalamat din sa inyo because we have Boy Basibas, Val Chauka and Adretti Stevens. Chauka, that's a lot of space and he makes Bulacan pay. Yeah, even if he's been side of Mark Sarangay. Sarangay is back but he could not stop. The Flores inside. Sebastian is rejected. What a block about it. It could have been a block by two people by the way. Oh, it's actually Sarangay who blocked it first. Into their offense. Well, you could expect that with the two new additions at the point guard position as Jera Flores steps back for that three-pointer. <laughs> I was supposed to bring that up. There's the step back by J.R. Flores. You mentioned in the first half, Falchauka double-teamed, strong pass, a bit too strong, but the recovery was there. Barba, some space, crossover against Daniel De Guzman. No good, rebound, Saranga, he's dominating inside. Five on the shot clock. Gilmer De La Torre. Three-pointer. Yes. Gilmer De La Torre. Three. One of the great. Yeah. On to Kentoy Segura. Cross over. Down the middle. Layup is good. Pass inside. Andretti Stevens to Justin Alano. Early in this game. There's a feed inside. Another exceptional pass. From Andretti Stevens. Nothing unsportsmanlike. Fake. And the jump shot for Val Chauka. Down the hatch. Para dito sa Bacolod. Nine points down for Val Chauka. Jeric Fabian. Jeric Fabian. His turn to fire. Finally, a shot goes in. Intense sequence from both scores. Nang tatay nilang mag basketball. Matas man ang competition within the family. Ganon din kataas ang expectation sa kanya na maganda palagi ang performance pero down. JR Flores spinning and making that shot off the glass and in. As scoring wise, he's able to set up his teammates. Matiliano able to get a score. JR Flores, the leading scorer of Bulacan, fading away. Yes, sir. When game Val Chauka. With his hair now flying around, he gets fouled. And you still give a chance for the other team. <laughs> for Bacolod. But Chauka makes the second. The arrival of Junior MPBL Ang Liga ng Bawa again this July 9. Of course, big shout out to Commissioner Keith Picasso and Executive Director J.R. Navarro as Tomar Patiliano now working with Guevara. Pass inside. Good timing by Jeremy. It's now for Justin Guevara. Puroy Cantibuan, he loves that move. Takbo sa kabila. J.R. Flores, two men to beat. Inside they go to Jem Cruz. Excellent for the score. Eight points now for Jem Cruz. Three out of seven from the field. Val Chauka answers back. Val Chauka. Stopping and popping. That's a three. When he's walking up that ball that blew by the defense, again, we mentioned no interior help para sa Puyas, especially on that previous play. And there was a three-point shot knocked down by Valchauka. His left hand 
One more chance for Bacolod. Chauka has it. Tough shot. Oh, he makes it. Wow. Jumper. Pure through the net. More importantly, Bacolod now has the lead. 75-74. J.R. Flores and cross court. Flores with the fake. Corner. Fabian. Three-pointer. Yes, sir. That time, mid meat of the defense. Kahit ganang pakahirap ang iba mo sa kanya, he'll always find a way. There's that setup on the right corner. Starting the season 4-1. and one. They've already lost four straight games entering in today's matchup. Yes. The chase for Basibas. Good feed at the last second, but a better block. And the recovery yes. for out. Fabian Liner. He gets the bounce. Yes. Under three minutes. Bacolod down by one. Chauka again. He escapes. Two plus one. Yes. Tried to put multiple defensive coverages on him. He denies the screen set by Sarangay, recognizes that there would be... One-point ball game, Raflores stepping back for the lead. Too strong, rebound Fabian, what a play! Here the flashing JR Raflores, Sarangay now is pushed outside of the paint and it's only Basibas and those two guards, Katimbuan and... Go Puroy still has it on the drive. Tough pass. Recovery for Alano. Two seconds. Kantim Buhan gives Bacola the lead with 1.4 seconds to go. Puroy, and then the one-hander all net by Kantim Buhan. Two breaks of the games going their way on that possession. And hey, this is not over. Masibas shouting Aliyup Langto. Jem Cruz for the win. No good. And the Bacola City of Smiles win it. It was a decent look by Jim Cruz. In fact, Matiliano 